Hi, I'm James with the Brains Report, and I'm here to unbox the Echo B or a Kobe ECOBEE4 smart thermostat. Um, and it also has this uh, switch thing that makes it so you can control your light switches. Uh, they sent me this for free to test. Uh, we could really use it because our thermostat that controls the entire house is located in our guest room. So if we have guests over, they have complete control over our comfort, and that's unacceptable. I uh, also sometimes like go to bed and forget to turn the temperature way down, and um, I figure the smart thermostat, I can program it to just automatically turn it down or I can adjust it from the comfort of my bed without having to come downstairs and wake up some sleeping guests. There we go. It's got some uh, it just says take comfort when you bring home an Kobe. You are also doing something good for our planet by reducing your energy usage and environmental footprint. That's something. And just a stupid pack and see. Uh, so here are the two things. They sell these as a bundle um, in various places. Uh, I'm hoping I can figure out how to use these. <laughs> um, let's, let's crack it open, why don't we? I will open the the smart thermostat first. Uh, if you go to the Kobe website, they they have a thing that that shows you if um, your your home is compatible with the thermostat. Uh, you kind of have to take off the cover for your current thermostat and uh, check out the wires. Uh, kind of see what's under the hood find out if you're compatible. It's got a little B. There it is. Oh, look at that. It's got an interesting uh, plastic smell to it. It'll go up on your wall. This will go somewhere. It says hello to you. Lots of paperwork here. I don't know if we're really going to get too far into this, but it's got some labeling your wires. How to install your room sensors. Uh, how to install your uh, Kobe 4. And um, I just really hope this is in multiple languages. It's kind of hard to flip through it easily for you. Um, but yeah, it's. Uh, there might be some involved stuff. It shouldn't be too involved. Because um, someone like me should be able to install it, and I don't know much of anything. I'm going to just put this back here so I don't lose it. Here we've got some uh, screws and some uh, things for where you don't have a stud or whatever for drywall. I don't remember what they're called. Uh, this looks really complicated. I hope I don't have to mess with this too much. Oh, I'm glad it came with one of these. No clue what it is. You got a little QR code and this. Um, yeah, this might be hard for me, but I think I can do it. And there you go. You got wires and buttons, and uh, I feel like after I complete this, I'm gonna feel like a real man, like a real handyman. Like I can tackle anything. Um, 
or I screw it up. Who knows? <laughs> I'm nervous. Okay, uh, let's look at the Ecobe switch. Uh, this is for you know lights. It it'll will sense if no one's there and turn lights off. Which is great in a home like mine where everyone likes to keep all the lights on at all times. And I don't like that. It's not good for the environment, not good for the bills. Open up to a brighter future. It's basically a smart light switch thing. And all sorts of cords. You have to do some more stereotypical manly stuff. Little cover thing. Uh, little marker caps. Nothing down there. Up here is where you get all your info. How do you install your Echo B Switch Plus? Little black foot. Don't electrocute yourself. off your circuit breakers, do a bunch of handyman things, yeah. So I've got my work cut out for me. Um, this is just the unboxing. I'm going to, uh, as soon as we get done with this, I'm going to install everything and use it for at least a month. And then I'm going to hop back on YouTube uh, immediately and let you know uh, if this is something that's worth your money. Um, yeah, in the meantime, stay warm.